It's Taylor time, and today we're talking about all the hottest sunglass styles. Now, sunglasses are a fashion necessity you'll want to get right. And Jeanette is here from Optique Del Mar to help us do just that. Hi, Jeanette. Hey, Taylor. Now, tell us what are the most chic trends in sunglasses this summer? Well, if you thought aviators were hot last year, this year they're even hotter. You cannot go wrong with a great pair of aviators. They're all over the place, celebrities are wearing them, and it doesn't matter, males, females, big lenses, small lenses, aviators cover the gamut. They're, they are the classic go-to glass. So it doesn't matter what shape of face nope. or if you're a man Nothing. or woman. What about like to they've, dress up or dress absolutely. up? Absolutely, they've got, they've got shiny, they've got mirrored, they've got non-shiny, they've, they, Everything. Aviators and, are the are the best. And you said celebrities are still wearing this oh, in sunglasses. Yeah. Oh gosh, yeah. So down the red carpet Absolutely. or taking Absolutely. their kids to the park. It doesn't matter. Yep. All right, cool. Yeah. What else you got? Big frames. Can't go wrong with the big frames. Now this look has been and, in for a few years. And the it's big not frame. going anywhere. Hollywood loves it. It's not going anywhere. You, you know. And it's, all the designers make the big frame. Everybody frames. makes them. Okay. You can't go wrong. With I the feel pair. like the big frames are more of a dress up sunglass anyhow because they always have some sort of bling some no not hardware. necessarily because you can do you know these with no bling at all and they're still yeah. big frames so you can dress up or dress down these, these are still in style because these have been out for a couple years these are hot these are always hot. Still? always they're a good investment though. they're what a good you investment you can't okay. go wrong with them all right what else classic wayfarers Oh yeah, I Classic. see the younger Classic. generation wearing these. Yeah. Like my they daughter, the teenagers love them. Yes, they and went away for a while. Now they're making a big, huge comeback with the. I know the younger generation loves them, but what about Hollywood? Absolutely. What celebrities are wearing Still, them? Still, um, I'm pretty sure Kara Knightley. Ah. Yeah, seen them. Well, oh yeah, there's so many. Kara it's a great look I too. I like Kara Knightley. And then we've also got a lot of men's stuff. Oh, well, hey, let's talk about men's stuff. Let's bring in Anthony, a uh, dear friend of mine who's also a comedian and actor and co-host sometimes. Hi, Anthony. Hello, ladies. Okay, so we were talking earlier about sunglasses and your biggest challenge. You need to elaborate on that. <laughs> uh, I have a gigantic head. I'm surprised <laughs> if I'm in the frame right now. It's enormous. Wide so, mode. so basically, you don't want him to try on your sunglasses because exactly. he'll, he'll, he'll stretch them out. out. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So what kind of sunglasses do you look for then? Oh, geez. Um, I have many pair. I lose and break all my sunglasses. So I, but you know, a lot of guys make the classic mistake of just wearing one pair of sunglasses or having one pair of sunglasses and expect that to cover the array of events and moods that they might be in. Actually, moods? Yeah, moods. So I'll give you um, every. <laughs> I name all my sunglasses. Like, okay, let's go for it. These would be my uh, uh, Tony at the track glasses because I'd, I'd wear these if I was going to the Del Mar race track uh, for the races, and I want to kind of look like I could be a horse owner in the mafia. Give me the trifecta, Tommy. <laughs> Another martini, no olives. If I want a salad, I'll get a salad. <laughs> so like that, and then maybe, oh, here we go. These are like kickback to like uh, 1980s. Oh, I like those. Like Put very, those very on. Very cool little tortoise shell. Those like, look like I look like I'm closing deals. I, yeah. I can no, you that. need a Gucci suit for those. Those oh. are beautiful on I you. I love more it. more like St. Elmo's Fire. Give me a dangly earring and a saxophone. I'll do a Rob Lowe for you right now. <laughs> and, um, what else? Let's see. Oh, well, these are kind of like, uh, where are they? These are a little this, bit wider. Uh -huh. These will cover, these are like second prize at the dance contest. You get punched out at the bar, cover yeah, the black eye. That's kind of that retro look. Yeah. What about for sports? Like if a weekend you're playing volleyball, riding bikes, what, what, is a good pair to wear? Oh, Oakley's. Oakley's are very sporty. Mm -hmm. You know, they're, they're, they're definitely like a bike riding sunglasses. They, don't, they won't shake off. Look at this. Look at them. They're hanging yeah. out like that. You can be diving for death volleyballs roll. there. I could be an alligator death roll with these on. They won't come off. <laughs> and they're durable. Yeah, and they're reflective they are. lens. Which are is good. good for me because I'm always sitting on them and losing them and dropping them. Yeah. <laughs> and, and again, I'm sure it's really important that all glasses uh, reflect UVA and UVB rays, right? Absolutely. Silly. Okay. Absolutely. So I have a problem. I have very high cheekbones. Some people might. I think it's a problem, but it's a problem when I'm trying to find the right pair of sunglasses. Which one would be good for me? So I think you would need a bigger frame. So these Ray-Ban aviators are going to be awesome for that. And this is the bridge That's you're the talking bridge, about. And it's going to help lift it up off your face. Wow. Perfect. perfect. Is it a good look? Oh Am I pulling God. it? And yeah. it's not digging into my cheekbones, which is right perfect. Right. Okay, so let's talk about a round face. Many of my friends um, have beautiful round faces, but they say they have a hard time too. They can't wear every sunglass. What's a good glass for them? This big oversized frame would be really good. And why is that good? It'll help balance the face. Oh, nice. I like that. It's almost a, like the right sunglasses is just as important as the Absolute, right outfit. Like absolutely. if you're going to wear a tight skinny jeans, you got to wear a bigger mm -hmm. bluster top. Yeah. I love it. Balance. Heavy eyes, less lipstick. There you go. See so you important. So I can't important. I any horizontal stretch. <laughs> so don't wear a like horizontal. A, like a like <laughs> All right, enough. <laughs> enough. Yeah. Let me. Okay, so what is the ideal face? What face can pull any style? This face. 
<laughs> I, why did I know she was going to say that? <laughs> right. It also helps that she was a model. Anyhow, thanks for tuning in to Taylor Time. Stay in the know. Tune in every other week. Have a great day.